All right, so this effect is really simple to do, and if you want to see how to place an image inside of a shape, don't miss my tutorial on that, which you can click on right here. But I wanted to make an example for text as well. So I'm in Photoshop and I've just got a blank canvas open, and what you want to do is go ahead and grab your text tool and type out your word. So I'll type NY for New York, and then I'll grab my move tool and I'll put it in place. Uh, one important tip is if you go to window, character, here you can actually highlight your text and you can adjust things like the size and the tracking, which is how close together or far apart the letters are from each other. So once you have everything set how you want, um, again, grab your move tool, place it where you want, I'll put mine in the center, and have your image open in Photoshop. So I've got my image of the New York City skyline and I'll grab it, I'll grab the layer, and I'll drag it onto the canvas we're working on. So now you can see I have my image layer on top of my text layer on top of everything else. This is the most important thing to make sure you have, so it's not going to work if your image isn't directly above your text layer. So now I'll move it around to a spot that I want, and in order to put it inside of the text, you want to go to Layer, Create Clipping Mask. So that'll tell Photoshop to only show what's on this layer within the bounds of this text layer. So from here, you can continue moving around or scale it down and transform it. But that's how to place an image inside of a text in Photoshop. So thank you guys so much for watching. Again, if you missed how to place an image inside of a shape, you can watch that tutorial here. And make sure you subscribe to my channel to stay tuned for future tutorials. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to leave them below and I'll try to help you out. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time.